Hey guys, if, you, if you're like me, you got one of these Label Rider 4XLs and it's so frustrating. Seems like it's always kicking out extra labels. And so I buy, I don't buy the, the expensive Dymo ones. I buy these off Amazon or eBay and uh, save a ton of money on them. And there's no reason they shouldn't work. And uh, so I actually run a lot of labels through here. Uh, make sure when you put your labels in, this is nice and tight. So I don't obviously have new labels that I just ran out. But what I realized was, um, and maybe because of how many labels we actually run through here, but you'll notice on this side, let me grab a pen so I can kind of point at it. You'll notice right here, um, what I did is I took a little rubber washer and some hot glue and I glued it in there. What it does, is it keeps this, for lack of better word, words, uh, spindle nice and straight. I think what was happening is it was tilting and then um, as the labels would go through, it would hit this little spot where are they at on these labels? Anyways, right here. It would hit that little spot here because it was on a little bit of an angle. It would think that there was not a label in the machine. It would kick it out. And so not to jinx myself, but I've probably ran 2,000 labels, 3,000 labels through here in the last uh, little while. And uh, that little fix right there, which I just kind of came up with just because I could see, again, the spindle was at an angle. And uh, so, again, give it a try. Again, I got a little rubber, maybe it's plastic, a little washer, just a little hot glue in there. And I'm sure it'll wear off after time. And I'll just put another one in there. But for me, it's definitely fixed it. So hope uh, that helps somebody out there.